This week on the Highlander Report, soldiers of the 1st Armored Division took part in the Iron Scout competition. The scouts from each brigade participated in a series of events including a physical fitness challenge, a combat water survival test, and a reconnaissance mission. I definitely feel like with the team that we uh, built, we had a lot of great camaraderie. We really knew how to work together with each other. Whatever one person struggled with, the other one helped and picked the other one up. There was not a point in time where we left that one individual out by himself and kind of w made him work on his own. If somebody was falling back on the run, we ran together with him. We definitely worked with each other on weekends, weekdays, after work, we put the hours in. Winners of this grueling and exhausting event will travel to Fort Benning, Georgia to compete against scout teams from all over the United States in the Ganey Cup Scout Competition. Uh, there's always training to be done, always training to be had. Uh, every single opportunity, again, that we have to be provided, we're going to take advantage of it full force. Uh, Training won't stop. Even as soon as we hit boots on ground in Georgia and we go for the Ganey Cup, the training doesn't stop. The winning team, Staff Sergeant Garza, Sergeant Tavares, Specialist Phillips, Specialist Bloxon, and Specialist Willis from 41AD were awarded a trophy and a set of Army Achievement Medals by Major General Stephen Twitty, Commanding General, 1st Armored Division in Fort Bliss. Uh, I would have to say that anybody in the 19 Delta Cavalry community, uh, this is definitely something that you want to strive for. Uh, if you feel that you know you really want to get in depth in your profession and, and really dig into it, this is an amazing opportunity. And you know, I challenge everyone out here to come out here and compete, and uh, and just try this event because it's it's definitely rewarding. Brigadier General Retired Richard A. Bernhausen acted as guest speaker for the award ceremony. Your service is validated, you warrant it, and needed, and your tough training is important because you are going to dodge bullets and you are going to dodge IEDs. And you volunteered to do it. For 41AD and Fort Bliss, I'm Army Sergeant Mike Grimm. And as always, that's your Highlander Report.